This is the ASDEN WXL Pro wireless microphone system. It's a popular choice for DSLR shooters needing a flexible alternative to the crappy onboard mic. It has a transmitter with a lavalier mic and a receiver that easily mounts on the hot shoe. It also adds a bit of badassery to your camera. I'm not sure it'll get you a girlfriend, but it will probably help you seem more professional while you interview somebody for your vlog. The most exciting thing about this microphone was getting a package in the mail. After that, it went downhill pretty quickly. First thing I noticed was the cheap, plastic feel of all the parts. I wasn't expecting this to be Neumann quality. After all, this is something that sells for $150 on Amazon. It should do the job, although I suspect the belt clip will be the first part to break. It's weaker than the argument for intelligent design. I mounted the receiver on my Canon 60D. I turned it to channel 1 and plugged my in-ear monitors into the earphone output. I heard lots of noise. It sounded more like loud tape hiss. I tried channel 2, but the hiss was still there. This is the sound from the mic on my Canon 60D. It's decent enough, you're not going to track a vocal through it, but it gets the job done. This is the ASDEN WXL Pro wireless microphone. It's probably difficult to ignore the amount of hiss intruding on everything I'm saying. I've heard cleaner recordings from Enrico Caruso. You'd probably get better results just calling your friend's iPhone, plugging in the headphone out to your camera. This microphone is like a hooker. It costs you good money, and it probably works better after it's fixed. I didn't hear much in the way of interference, and the range seemed decently reasonable. Hello! probably about 30 feet, but I can never find a way to get rid of that loud hiss. Changing channels didn't help, and adjusting the audio levels on my camera didn't improve the noise to signal ratio. It was there no matter what I did, and that's why you should look elsewhere for a wireless lavalier mic. The last bit of advice I'll give you, remember to remove your batteries before sending this mic back. <laughs>